morning. So in this video, we are going to see a recruitment news from Railtel Corporation of India Limited. So there is actually a recruitment or opening for graduate and diploma people and it is actually an apprenticeship recruitment. Okay, so if you are interested in doing apprenticeship jobs, please do watch this video till then. Otherwise, you can skip this video. Okay, so let us see the post details, the qualification, application procedure, everything in this video. So first, let us see the post details. Okay. So there is a recruitment happening for the post of graduate and diploma trainees or trainee engineers. So this is actually an apprenticeship job and the branches they are calling or the fields they are calling are electronics and telecommunication, computer science, civil engineering, electrical and electronics. Now if you don't know what is actually Railtel Corporation, it is actually a telecom infrastructure provider type of company. Okay, So it is mainly focusing on the electronics and telecommunication branch okay it is a telecommunication infrastructure provider infrastructure provider company okay now the number of vacancies is 68 total 68 vacancies is there they have not given the split up of how many te uh, technician apprentice and how many graduate apprentice totally they have given the vacancies as 68 okay and the duration of training uh, will be for one year and the stipend that you are getting on a monthly basis is 14,000 rupees for graduate apprentice and 12,000 rupees for diploma apprentice or diploma engineers. Okay, so that is the stipend details. Next is uh, the qualification that you are requiring. So for graduate apprentice, for just like any other apprenticeship job for graduates, you require a full time four year graduation engineering in telecommunication electronics and telecommunication, computer science, engineering or civil engineering, information technology, electrical and electronics, electronics engineering, electronics and instrumentation, all branches of electronics are eligible and also civil, all the other branches are actually eligible, okay. And also same for diploma, okay. Next, the age limit is from 18 to 27 years is the age limit, okay. 27 years is the maximum age limit they are saying. And also, this is not applicable for final years. If you are an undergraduate, this is not applicable for you. And also, if you have completed three years after you are uh, engineering or diploma, again, then you are not eligible. Okay. If you have completed three years after graduation, means not applicable. Next, if you have already done some apprenticeship job, if you have, uh, if you are an experience, work experience, if you have, again, then you are not eligible. Okay. So these all things they have mentioned in the. In the notification specifically the last date for applying i'm telling it very beginning itself it is 11th of january is the last date for applying next selection process okay selection process is initially there will be a scrutiny or uh, short listing of applications after the short listing there will be an interview and selection is purely based on this interview only okay so there is only interview, there is no fee and there is no examination also, okay. So if you are interested in doing apprenticeship job, again, there is a golden opportunity for you. Okay, next. Next is application procedure. Next is application procedure. So for applying, first you have to enroll yourself into www.mhrdnavs.gov.in. So this is the basic procedure that you have to follow if you are interested in doing any apprenticeship job, okay, for Diploma and graduate people. This site you have to follow www.mhrdnatsdov.in. Okay, here you have to first enroll yourself, get your specific enrollment number. After getting your enrollment number, you have to click for re uh, request for establishment menu. That menu you have to click. You have to select this Railtel Corporation and apply online. Okay, so you have to enter your uh, fields for various uh, areas. You have to fill up the form and apply online. Now, if you have any confusion regarding this uh, mhrdnats.gov.in, the site registration process or applying process, in the notification towards the end, they have actually given specifically, specifically with images also. That is for whichever which all fields you have to enter, what all things they have given the application procedure in detail. Okay, along with images. So, if you have any trouble while applying, you can. Make use of this images and this notification. Okay, so that is the application process. So I'm really hoping that uh, you found the video useful. The last date I want to tell it once again. It is 11th of January. There is enough time, but please don't wait till that. Apply for it as soon as possible. Okay, 
since there is no fees a lot of applications will be actually coming a lot of people is actually eligible so please do apply for it as soon as possible okay so if you found the video useful please do give it a thumbs up please do share it with all your graduate friends and your diploma friends and if you want more videos please do subscribe to the channel thanks for watching and keep on watching